Put your phone away. Next time I see it, I'm gonna take it away. Oh, sorry. This is mine. I told you to put your phone away. You can get it back at the office. Hi, my name is Ella, and today we are going to be interviewing some people. My name is Ella, and this is... And I'm Daniela. Um, so we would like to ask you some questions today. What do you think about students using their phones during lunch? I think students should be able to use their phones during lunch so that they could have like a break from learning. But, yeah. And do you think some graders should be able to use our phones? Um, I think all grades should be able to use their phones, but obviously not like when someone's teaching, but during like maybe the passing period or lunch, they should be able to use their phones. Um, thank you. Yeah. Is that This is Andrew Jimenez. Okay, so we would like to ask you some questions today. What are the pros and cons about people using their phones here? Uh, some pros are that uh, are that they can talk to their parents and they can talk with people. And some cons are that um, they're not being really social and they're spending more time on their screen, which is kind of a bad thing. And do you think some parents should have the privilege to use their phones during lunch? Yes, I think that anyone should need uh, should use their phone if they need it, like if they're having an emergency. And last question: How is it like being able to go on your phone during lunch? Um, I'm not usually on it that much. I'm usually talking to people, um, but it's kind of nice because you can just have it there ready in case anything happens. And thank you for your time. Hi, I'm Valerie, and I'm with Miss Quince. Okay, so um, today we're going to be asking you a few questions about why we should be able to use our phones during lunch. Okay, so first question is, why do you think we shouldn't be able to use our phones during lunch? I don't think you should be able to use your phone during lunch because the lunch period is so short and fast and it's the time to be eating. Okay, um, thank you for that. Um, and <laughs> what, what would you do if you saw a kid with their phone at lunch? If I saw a student with their phone on at lunch, because it is school policy not to have phones, I would tell them to put it away. And the second strike, I would take it. And what is your opinion on using phones at lunch? My opinion on using phones at lunch? Yeah. <laughs> Same as um, the first question. Lunch is so short, it's the time to be eating and um, socializing. So why would you want to be staring at your phone anyway? Okay, thank you. Hey, I'm Mr. Wood. Okay, um, so today we're going to be asking you a few questions about um, uh, phone What am I doing for winter break? No. About my sorry. favorite movie? No, sorry. Okay. So about um, phone usage during okay. lunch. Phone usage during lunch. Go for it. Okay, so why do you think students should be able to use their phones during lunch? Well, that's insinuating I think they should be able to use them during lunch. Okay. I'm not a big fan of that. I think that our phones need to be off and away during school hours. We do enjoy that the kids can use their phones like during morning arrival and the NPR and one of the gyms. But I think when that bell rings and we're back into our classrooms or in the hallway or lunchtime or PE, phones should be off and away. I know it's a distractor. I know it's so easy to want to check everything, but we just got to make sure we're staying on task in school. Okay, thank you. Um, so why shouldn't we able to be, to be using our phones during lunch? So, kind of answer that question right there, right? Kind of answer it a little bit. I think one of the bigger problems that I'm noticing is that once, sometimes when we're so engaged in our phones, just like last year when we were so connected just remotely online, we're just all virtual kind of stuff, we lose the little joys of just interacting with our peers in positive ways in person, right? Like my wife tells me all the time, put your phone away, don't do your work stuff at the dinner table or when we're, you know, getting ready to put our kids in a bathtub or getting ready for bed, there's time to put it away and just have interactions in person. And I think that's the best thing we can kind of do as we're kind of re-entering this school year and continuing to crush it like you guys have been crushing, doing a great job. But sometimes it's good to just put the phone away, focus on positive stuff, and connect later. Because yeah. everyone's here, right? We can just yeah, have I conversations here. <laughs> okay, last question. Yes, go for it. Why do you think teachers take away our phones if, um, if they have it out? So we have some, and you know, there's a lot of social media outlets. There's a lot of distractors on the phone. Like I know, like when I want to check my even my fantasy football with some friends I have outside of school, right? There's so many things that you want to just look at quickly, and it could easily domino effect into longer times on the phone and distract you and take you away from what you should be doing. 
I think sometimes when teachers are noticing these trends and kids have a hard time remembering off and away or keeping your locker or stuff like that. Like even if you got yours in your pocket right there, right? Yeah. It's hard. It's hard sometimes. And I'm not dissing you. I'm not making fun of you. It's, just, it's hard sometimes. And I think the more we can kind of get that message to ourselves and keep reminding ourselves like this is not the time and the place for our phones, the better. But sometimes teachers have to take it away as a friendly reminder for some of our kiddos. Especially, you know, some of our sixth graders who are just new to our building, still getting the use of it being a middle schooler. But yeah, we always got to make sure we're just making good choices and keeping them off. But yeah, okay. that's why I think teachers are taking them away. Thank you. Yes, thank you. Have a good one.